welcome to day 36 of this awesome beard growth. Now, what's cool about this beard is it never existed before, so it's coming out now. But, talking about things existing and coming back to life, there's this insect called the tree lobster, or the Lord Howe insect, stick insect, which was believed to be extinct. Now, Lord Howe Island is a little island off the south of Australia. And one day, the ship was coming along and it broke down, so it went, all the passengers went onto the island to wait for the ship to be fixed. Now, the thing is, other passengers on the ship, known as rats, also made it to shore. They went to this island where this stick insect lives, and it only lives there. It's the largest, what is it, the largest flightless stick insect in the world. It lived there, and only on this island. So the rats came in and went, Mmm, these things taste nice, and ate them, and after about two years, populated that much, because we all know what rats do, is <laughs> all the time. And then they went and ate out, and everyone believed that these insects were extinct. Now, fast forward from 1900s, like 1900, 1902, to 1960s, where these two people decided to climb a mountain that's called... Ball's Pyramid, okay, because the guy that saw it, his name was Ball, so he was like, I'm going to call that Ball's Pyramid, that's not going to be funny at all in 2012, but anyway, so it's the, it's a, like a volcano that from the ocean that came out, so it sticks up, it's really sh narrow, and it just looks like a big rock sticking out of the ocean, so two people were climbing in the 1960s, and were like, ooh, there's these, uh, insect looking cases so it's like you know when an insect sheds its skin they were saying ooh it looks like the lobster thing and so then that was it and then fast forward to 2001 two scientists go over there to go maybe we can find it so they go over there and they climb this thing and they don't find too much and then as they're climbing down they find these droppings that they think could be insects so then they get back down and they wait until night time because the Insects are nocturnal, so they go climb up this, like it's, it's pretty dangerous climbing up this thing to find these insects. And they find 24 of these tree lobsters that were believed to be extinct. Now they got to keep four of them for scientific reasons to bring them back. Only two survived the trip. Luckily the two that did survive the trip were male and female. Um, and so since 2001 they've been able to repopulate these insects and now there's enough to reintroduce them to their environment. Now their environment is Lord Howe's Island. And the problem is, is the rats are still there. It's expensive to get rid of rats. And B, people are there. Imagine having these new insects roaming about. Which I don't think is a problem because they're nocturnal. They like to be on trees. If you're walking through the bush and one lands on you, I don't know, it's just an insect. Gosh, flick it off, put it back on the bush, whatever. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Thought to be extinct because of humans. Now, not extinct because of humans. Well, populating more because of humans. So let's put them back on the island, I say. Give them back their rightful place. That's where they should be. Alright, thanks for watching. I think it's cool finding out stuff like this. Sorry if I'm a bugger geek or whatever. But yeah, thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, and here's the beard. It's the longest it's ever been.